Are you using multiple chatbots and just get really frustrated with going between one and the other and copy and pasting and doing all those things? Well, I'm going to blow your mind today. And I just might change your workflow for uh, at least for the next couple of weeks. My name is Harrison Painter, your Chief AI Officer, and this is your video of the day. Let me introduce you to Poe. This is an amazing platform. Now, I've only been on it for 48 hours, but it's already completely changed my workflow. Poe has its own chatbot, very similar to ChatGPT and Gemini and all the other ones. But what makes this platform special is it gives you access to multiple chatbots, all in the same thread. And I'll explain that in just a second. But as you can see here, you have their chatbot, then you have access to the brand new Llama 3, which is that 70B-T. You have all the clauds in here, including Opus. You have ChatGPT4. You have Dolly 3. You have Gemini, Stable Diffusion, and it just goes on and on and on here. Now, I do need to point out that in order to access Claude Opus and GPT-4, you do have to have a subscription, but it's $20 a month. So you're already paying that maybe for ChatGPT-4. You would be paying that for Opus, so you could actually pay that one time here and have access to both of them. Now, I still would have to keep my GPT-4 account because we have a lot of custom GPTs over there. We have a business group GPT. And... That, But for, for, for a lot of people, this might be a really, really good option for you. Now, let's just, uh, I was just in a meeting before here and an interesting question popped up in it. So I want to ask that question here and just see what we can come up with as a demonstration. So the question that got thrown around the room was, what is the number one safest city to live in the United States if there was a nuclear attack? So let's see what Poe answers for this. So this one is stating Denver, Colorado. Now, here's what's cool. You can compare this to, let's compare it with the new llama. Let's see what happens there. And what I want you to notice, it's keeping all of it in the exact same thread. So it's, it's giving you these answers. You don't have to continually retype it. It has the memory from the other bot that you were using. This one is now saying Green Valley, Arizona, where... The Poe chatbot said Denver, Colorado. Now let's take a look and see what Gemini says. Now this one's going in a even deeper route. So Butte, Montana, Bismarck, North Dakota, Cheyenne, Wyoming, Charleston, West Virginia, Boise, Idaho. So you can see you got three different results from the three different chatbots. So now at least you have a foundation to go do more research. So you have, what is that? You've got uh, four, five, six, seven cities now that you can do research on to see what the best one is. And I would love to show you the, the. I don't have a subscription to this yet, but then you could plug in GPT-4, you could plug in the other ones. The only one that I'm really upset that it doesn't have at this point is perplexity, but hopefully they'll be adding that in the near future. So I just wanted to share this with you real quick. Check it out. Get in there. As I experiment, I'll probably do another video on this later, but I was very excited, wanted to share it with you and make sure that you had this tool in your hands. All right. Well, that's it for me today. I hope you found value here. My name is Harrison Painter, your Chief AI Officer. And until tomorrow, keep innovating and God bless. Thank you.